The long-awaited presidential address finally came, but with more unexpected news. President Uhuru Kenyatta extended partial lockdown in counties of Nairobi, Mombasa and Mandera with further 30 days. Cessation of movement into and out of the Nairobi metropolitan area, Mombasa and Mandera be further extended by 30 days. That the nationwide dusk to dawn curfew currently in force until today, the 6th of June 2020, is extended for a further 30 days. But to Isli and Old Town Mombasa, the presidential address was good news. President Uhuru Kenyatta announced lapsing of lockdown for two estates. Further, the president announced extension of the curfew in the country, though adding more hours of freedom starting tomorrow. That the cessation of movement into and out of Isli area of Nairobi and the specific limitations in force with respect to the Old Town area of Mombasa that is currently in force shall lapse at 4 a.m. on the 7th of June. With the economy being a major concern to millions of Kenyans, the president says the economic stimulus package of 53.7 billion shillings in place, the economy will get a boost. He urged employers and landlords to be considerate during COVID-19 pandemic era. I continue to call upon all Kenyans, particularly landlords and employers, to put people before profits during these testing times. In his economy revival plan, President Kenyatta has also directed the transport ministry to come up with the model which will see domestic flights resume. International travel restrictions are hereby extended. In the meantime, the Ministry of Transport is directed within seven days from the date hereof to engage all key stakeholders and develop protocols and guide resumption of local air travel. Elizabeth Mutuko, TV 47 Nairobi.